Ik ben
I took over this department last year, April 2017. We were in the final stage of implementation of the World Bank Aided Project. It's about 1,500 crores. Closed it finally in December 2017. So, one of the innovations which we carried out in this project was a shift from the conventional contract to the performance based contracts. So, the other positive which we could take from this project was the strengthening of our professional competence. This was done in two ways. One, the World Bank helped us in getting a software developed which right from the conception stage to the execution stage, everything is on them. So starting with the preparation of the SDK, the uh, technical sanction, the administrative approval, the uh, e tendering process, and then award of work, execution, different stages of execution, quality control, the running payments, everything integrated, and you can see each and every project at any stage. So that is one which the department is now sharing with other indigenous departments of the state. The other thing which we did was the uh, training and capacity building of our officers, engineers. So these two things and the third thing which uh, was uh, as a pilot we undertook in situ stabilization of the pavement, a part of the old project. So that innovation, we are still continuing our studies on that patch of the road and our study has actually shown that it is doing better than the other pavements. It is cheaper, we are not wasting our materials, so we are not in the process of going in for yet another pilot to understand it a little better because that is going to be a little bigger about 10, 10 to 30 kilometer stretch. So uh, to cut it short, the, you know, we need to keep ourselves updated with the latest developments in the field, otherwise we will be left behind. But I would uh, uh, urge the Indian Association of Structure Engineers and CERC to devise, uh, you know, some capsules of ref refresher courses for the young engineers as well as the engineers who are at the middle level. That will help them in quickly getting them acquainted with the latest, you know, developments in this field. While the engineers at the, you know, middle level will be refreshing their skills, the engineers who are coming at the uh, entry level, they quickly need to pick up those technological innovations immediately because they are going to be a part of the process for a longer duration. Uh, these workshops do help in exchanging uh, you know, information. Uh, today's project is going to be, you know, uh, you are going to you know, 
vibrate on the design aspects, on the construction, on the planning, difficulties which they faced. And whether we could do it better, what lessons did we learn? Because it is still in the construction stage, we have to take some more time to get it completed. So these things do give you a lot of you know information and you can use it in your professional skills to manage and design, plan, take forward the other similar projects. The, there is no limit on the innovations, there is no going to be limit on the technological innovations which are going to happen in the field. But there is always a beginning. I congratulate IESC and CERC having organized this workshop for the professionals. I'm sure with this half a day here and a visit to the field will give you a complete picture of the project and the associated issues related with it. So with these words, I welcome you to all. You all to the city view people, people who are from outside the city. I'm sure you'll find it as beautiful as somebody must have told you. Please do have a round of the city. It's scenic beauty. And take back on memories of this city. These words. Thank you very much for giving me this opportunity. I'm happy to be part of this project, being part of the Department of the Public Works. Thank you.